Down there in the deep, deep sea, there are not a lot of nutrients, which means that per square mile, there cannot be a lot of anglerfish. In order to deal with this problem, the deep sea anglerfish has developed a fascinating evolutionary strategy. The females are born looking like this, like fish, and the males are born tiny, much, much smaller than the females. And basically, the male anglerfish is nothing except for a nose, a fin, and a pair of testicles. <laughs> and when that male deep sea anglerfish is born, he is born with all the calories that will ever be available to him. He cannot eat. All that he can do is smell. And the only smell that he cares about is the smell of the female deep sea anglerfish. And he spends his whole life chasing that smell. And if he is lucky, one day, he finds a female anglerfish, and when he does, he bites her on the side. <laughs> and an enzyme in her skin slowly dissolves his lips. It's true. <laughs> and her circulatory system begins to merge with his until eventually her heart beats for him. Aww. And he becomes a pair of nuts on her side. <laughs> My brother, by the way, that's called codependence. <laughs> my brother Hank thought this song, thought this, uh, my brother Hank thought that this, this story was so beautiful that he decided to write a song about it. It's called The Song About an Anglerfish, and he's been playing it. <laughs> Guess it's true that I once went through life as a guy who always had to rhyme life. Which right? I've been burned, I've been sprinting through it. All my friends I've learned. That love is not about whether you get stabbed, it's how slow the knife gets turned. But my friends, I found an animal who doesn't feel this pain. And my life is so much better now that I can do the same. Oh, you can't deny it. No one without lightning can't eat the fish. You've only ever eaten fish and you can't be alone if it's all you've ever known. Now the deep sea angler fish has no reason to be happy, but it has a great idea. What else to be? Well, the deep sea dwelling angler fish are asked to find a mate. They are always there together when it's time to procreate. See you wonder at night, on the lights, a female on her side, and then slowly he becomes a sperm producing parasite. Yeah, I don't even say he lives at all, he lives until she dies, and until that day he literally never leaves her side. Without like you can't eat the dish If you've probably ever eaten fish You can't feel alone if it's all you've ever known Yeah, the deep sea anglerfish Has no reason to be happy But it has a great idea What else to be?